Hello everyone. Today we're going to Festive Walk. So we're leaving uh, Savannah subdivision through the main gate and then we will just drive down to Manduria Plaza and hang a left there and then we are very soon at uh, Festive Walk on Mega World Boulevard. It's a nice and pretty sunny day today. It's really hot, so uh, luckily we're not going that far today. I think it will take about 15 minutes to get to a festive walk from here. All depending on traffic, of course, but uh, yeah, we will see. It is lunchtime, so it might be more traffic than usual. Last video, I think it was, we talked about the clubhouse here with the pool. As a resident here, you can actually rent the place to have your own events and uh, stuff. Let's sneak on the side here to avoid a cracked road. In about five days they are going to close this road down, up all the way up to the guard station. They are going to renovate the drainage and sewage system to uh, make it better when we have these huge rainfalls. One can only hope they will fix the road as they already do the work here, but yeah, as they say, he who lives will see. They are soon done with the uh, fixing of the drainage out here along the main road. As many other things I have mentioned before, the blue house here to the right is a water refilling station and the offices of Streamtech, the internet provider here in this subdivision, and First Peak, that is the water company. This part of the main road is nice because it's shadowed by all these big trees. It's nice since the sun is shining today and it is really hot. To the right is the entrance to the glades, a part of this subdivision. So here we come up to the main gate. To the right we have the shuttle station. There is a shuttle going through the subdivision, so if you don't have a car or a bike, you take the jeepney, who stops uh, up here at the main, main gate, and then you just walk down and take the shuttle that goes uh, to all parts of the subdivision. And finally, the Il Il Supermart has opened. They opened this Monday, a few days ago. There has been a lot of people, long, long queues. They have a 
good deals of the opening week. our flyover see how the traffic is here the bravest one is the one who gets past so as mentioned many times before this road is going straight down to Manduria Plaza someone asked me about the fuel prices here last week when I filled up my bike I paid 71.5 pesos per liter so that is a step up. Just uh, a month ago, I think we were close to uh, 59. Oh, according to that sign at that gas station, we are just dropped uh, below 70 again. 69 point something, I couldn't quite see. So far so good, not that much traffic yet. Talking about road, this road is also quite nice, not that uh, cracked or anything. Also at this gas station, under 70 now. So we're going in the right direction, it feels like. Andox, as we see here, the yellow sign to the right, is another Filipino fast food chain. Here we have another brave soul that is standing on the back of the jeepney. So we hit our first traffic, it seems like. There is construction going on, so we can do the sneaky sneaky driving. Now we can do some. And now we have a local driver in front of us, so we can follow him and see where it's safe to overtake.
Uh, we have a tricycle up here, it's gonna do a left turn. There he goes. Now the local driver is checking on the right side. Yes. No. You never know with these buses or modernized jeepneys if they're gonna just turn over to the right side and stop. So you have to be careful, as I said many times before. Now we're coming up on uh, Manduria Plaza. As usual, when you get close to the plaza, the road is uh, one way. Here we are, welcome to Manduria Plaza. So we're gonna take a left hand turn here. If you go to the right, you come down to where we go when we go to Vista Mall, and if we go straight, we actually will end up on the other side of uh, Mega World Boulevard. So when we go back, we will go uh, that way. Every time we have uh, driven this road, we have got stuck in some traffic. So it's possible we will do that today as well, because as I said, it is lunch time and all schools and everything are off for their lunch break. Let's do some sneaky, sneaky driving here. Get up behind the jeepney and pass him on the left. That went well. And suddenly the taxi wants to go to the right. So, okay, then I have to go to the left. I don't know why he did that. He is not gonna stop and or nothing. Uh, he was following me the whole way. The large building to the left. The distance is uh, on Mega World Boulevard, it's one of the condominium buildings. I can't say if it is uh, Madison or if it is Lafayette, but it is some of the ones we have mentioned before in this uh, video. Uh, well, straight ahead is the Madison, so I think the, right, the high one that we saw is Lafayette. So, we are coming up to Mega World Boulevard, to the right here we have McDonald's. So, we're gonna turn the right here up on onto the Mega World Boulevard. Here we have it, folks. Festive walk. So, we're gonna see if we can uh, find a place to park. Uh, nowadays, there is a parking fee here on the street. Uh, it is 30 pesos uh, flat rate for the day for a motorbike and I think it is 35 for a car. Don't hold me to that, but I think I saw that on the sign. 
Please subscribe if you don't want to miss out on the walk we're gonna do inside Festival in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.